Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Kofi and welcome back to the YouTube channel. As you guys can tell by today's title, we're going to be doing another player review. I've been bagging these out these last couple of weeks of the new foot birthday Louise Openda. Now let's just get straight into the card. Straight away we see his 5'10", high medium work rates. I went for the 5 star skills one over the 4 star, uh, over the 5 star weak foot. Uh, me personally, I chose this is because... With me, skill moves, I don't really care. I don't, know, I don't really care. It's I don't mind having four-star, four-star sign. But I thought with the skill moves, it opens up a bit more of your game. And I've been banging skills a lot again recently. So maybe it's probably a good chance uh, a Pender will work with me. Because in the past, a Pender's always had decent cards. But they just never worked for me. Like on paper, he looks good. But then he's really slow or something. Hopefully with like play styles in this year. Uh, and the way the game is, this one might be good. So let's have a look at the card. 98 pace. They ain't nothing better you can really get except like plus one sprint speed. 87 shooting is a bit weird. Uh, he's got very nice tech positioning. The finishing is solid. The shot power is decent. Like the, the more shot power they have, the better because then they can get into the tight angle near post shots or just, just smash them when you need to smash them. 79 long shots ain't a good look. 79 volleys ain't really the best. 83 penalties. So the last three aren't as important. Well, I think actually long shots and volleys are kind of important this year. If they want to do, try to do a little whip cross pass and you want to smash it straight. 81 passing. The vision is all right. The crossing's all right. Free kick, free kick accuracy don't really matter too much to me. 89 short pass is nice, but then 70 long pass and 70 curve is not the best. So I'm not even going to be trying to finesse with this guy. I'm not going to be trying to Travella with a Pender at all. So let's have a look at the dribbling. 89, uh, 87 dribbling is very decent. I like the agility. I like the balance. The reactions is decent. The composure could be better. Ball reaction, uh, ball control could be a bit better. Dribbling could be a bit better. As you guys can see, I've put a, a straight finisher on a Pender just to boost up the dribbling, boost up the agility. And just boost up the shot power as well. Shot power, I want a bit more up as well. Uh, 41 defender with 99 header inaccuracy. Can't complain of that at all. And 86 physicals. I love the jump in. Stamina is decent. I like it when my strikers have got strength because they don't get taken off the ball as much. And 82 aggression is very nice as well. Uh, he's got finesse shot white, chip shot white, power header yellow, technical white, rapid white, uh, quick step yellow, and Traveller white so the play styles are kind of weird like he's got fin he can finesse and he can travel but the curve ain't really there so i don't know how they're going to be looking uh this is the team we're going to run it with let's just get straight into the gameplay like even when he's got such dead curve the finesse is still there though not bad okay then from a panda. Yeah, Timo man, Timo's Timo man. Oh, 
Oh my god, the panda is cooking. No! Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, man. Let's go. Keep moving your keeper, bitch ass nigga. Keep moving your keeper. Bruh, this guy just came back to the game, bruv. Oh yeah, Pender's a bit saucy, man. Ooh. Oh, if he scored that, that would have been nuts. He'll just score this. Oh! Oh my days. Get off him. Get off him. Round the keeper. Get off him. <coughs> this happens when you do too much, man. This happens when you do too much. Is he, is he right footed? Is a pender right footed? I've been shooting on this left this whole time. Mm -hmm. Let's go. I'm just stat padding with a pender, man. Passion over oil, G. That was dirty. That was dirty. We're going to leave it there, man. So, guys, after four games, Appenda bagged himself 12 goals and one assist. The pros, he is quick. He is very, very, very fast. Uh, shooting is there. Sometimes it's not there. I was shooting mainly on his weak foot. I only just realised in the last game that he's right footed. So, on the left foot, it's not bad. I think I've had the five-star weak foot version. I think those shots would have been a lot better, but... The dribbling is actually decent. I like him. He is. He ain't as like silky as Jao Felix. Obviously, when you see these dribbling stats, you know that you're gonna know that for a fact. But the dribbling is there. The passing is kind of there. He can build up a little bit. The short passing is definitely there. I ain't never gonna try no attempt with long passing and that. But the uh, physicals are there. Uh, he's quick and he can even with some E curve. I tried the finesse. I tried the Javella. They both went in. So. Is he a card you should do? If you're looking for someone fun and new, give him a chance. You're not going to see too many men use him. He's not the most meta player, but he is a fun one. And I think he is about, I'm going to say about 250, 300k. Let me just double check really, really quickly. Let me just double check really quickly. I think he is about 300k. Yeah, for 300k and the amount of store packs that you can get so you can always have fodder. It's a decent car to do. And we're going to leave it there for today's video. So if you guys did enjoy, like, comment, subscribe, hit the little bell in the corner. As always, appreciate you guys for watching. Let me know if you men are going to do a pender. If not, love. <laughs>